Idaho Public Library to our annual volunteer breakfast. Our volunteers are gathering and will soon be eating. Um, I'd like to say a, a, a special um, thank you to all the volunteers in the library. They're extremely special people. They're loyal and, and uh, they work hard. Uh, they don't get paid, they don't get benefits, they don't get anything. And we do this uh, breakfast once a year. Hopefully, even in a small way, yeah. so thank you to them. Uh, later on, we'll be introducing them, and they'll be able to get up and oh. talk a little uh -huh. bit about what they do. I'd like to welcome Mayor White today and his wife, Alice. Alice is a village volunteer. <laughs> and um, they have some wonderful staff here that have gotten this breakfast together, and later on, you'll be hearing more about that. So thank you for joining us, and uh, we're going to eat now, and later on, we'll have our program. I'm lucky to have such a nice group of volunteers. I like to say, Mr. White, you can. Well, thank you very much. <laughs> I do want to offer my thanks to each of you. I know that you're here because you enjoy doing the work and uh, you meet some of your fine friends here, but it means such, so much to the village of Tuckahoe. Uh, as you know, with these tight budget uh, years, uh, not only in our community, but most places are uh, suffering from. Uh, certiaries that are lowering our tax bases and so on. So we, we try to do a lot uh, with uh, bigger resources. And the fact that we have the volunteers, we're able to offer the services here at the library that we would not ordinarily be, or be able to offer. So again, thanks to each of you uh, for the uh, great work that you do and uh, that I know that you're going to continue to do in the future. Thank you. <laughs> Hello. I, I have to say something else besides hello? Yes. yes. <laughs> I help with the book sale. <laughs> book sale, I should say. This is the lady in charge, though. Hi, this is uh, Kimmy Spicker, and uh, I run the book sale twice a year, and uh, I have these lovely ladies and my husband <laughs> who help us. <laughs> <laughs> they help they us, volunteer. and they really volunteer their time, and uh, they are very great help to me. Thank you. Mr. Spiker also. Uh, I, uh, last year they got mad with me for not speaking. They just said that I'm here. I just <laughs> help out my own little ways with the library, and that's about it for me. That's a okay. so big <laughs> house. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Camilla Adler, and I was sort of roped in by Kimmy a few years ago, <laughs> and I'm glad she did it because I enjoy doing it, and I think I'm getting to like Tucker more and more. Really good. I think the people are good. I'm Ross, I'm Ross Cerniak. I'm also helping with the book sale. And Camilla and I pick up loads and loads of books that we <laughs> <laughs> fill up her car with. And it's my year. It's one of the best book sales in Westchester. And, and also, and you help us oh. in the library, too. Oh. And I'm Another. doing a little repairing of books. It's a big job. On the side. On the side. On the side. Big job. Mrs. Just? I'm Connie Just, and I do whatever Swadish tells me. <laughs> 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 that, that's, I never know when I come in what I'm going to do today. But Swadish always has it lined up, <laughs> so that's my story. Uh, Mrs. Sachs? Well, hi, I'm Mrs. Sachs, and uh, it's a joy to work here and meeting all these other people. Gladys Cunningham. Yes, I'm Gladys Cunningham, and I'm in charge of keeping the magazines in order when Swadis tells me or other miscellaneous jobs. Swadis getting quite a reputation. Good thing I got the work. Hi, Defensive. Hi, this is my 16th year at the library. Um, I'm in charge of updating the bulletin boards and keeping the racks current and neat. And one of these days, I'm going to learn how to use the new computers. <laughs> <laughs> and when I do, I'll be back doing some work at the front desk as well. Have a great Charlotte Stiffel, one of our staff members. You're not? She doesn't do it. I don't see it. Yuko Ayoki, she's our volunteer and she's going back to Japan and wow. she's wonderful, she helps us a lot. Yeah. Um, <laughs> my name is Yuko and uh, I've been volunteering here for about uh, two years. 
and every every staff is kind, very kind, and I enjoyed working here very much. And it is it was a very wonderful experience for for me. And uh, after going back to Japan, I sh it, it surely is gonna be a good memory for me. Thank you. Thank you. of the Friends of the Library. And I also, I just want to make this one comment. I thank all the volunteers for their work because they do help uh, the library a lot. But one person in particular, Kibby Speaker, she runs our book sales. And if it wasn't for the book sales, we wouldn't have all that extra money to buy the extra videos we need and the programs. We pay for all the programs and all. And the book sales are our biggest contributor to the uh, library. We do send out campaign, we campaign for funds, but it doesn't bring, it brings in a third of what we bring in on the book sales. They are uh, very special to us, and I hope she continues doing it for us. And all her workers, they're wonderful. They work so hard. Thank you. Well, I'm not a volunteer here, but I do help around the village, and I want to thank you for inviting me to the breakfast this morning. Such thank a pleasure you. to have you. Thank you. Yes. And I'd like to thank you on the staff members and all that for marketing. Thank you. happy to see our volunteers because they're not just friends they're part of our family and unfortunately uh, every year Alice Barone would be our first guest here and I just want to remind everybody about how much she did and how she loved the library and that we miss her thank you Dr. Madeline Bigwin, Mrs. Anna Harris, Lynn Martin, Frances Mitchell. They are all very helpful to us. And for some reason, they can make it and like to appreciate the help. And thank you very much, Dewey, for doing all that. Yes. Thank <laughs> you.